Hi, my name is Tom and welcome at XPB. I'm going to be your instructor for today and if you have any questions at the end of the video, please ask us, we are happy to help. You can find our information right here. In this lesson, I'm going to show you what you need to get started with XPV. There's a few things you can prepare or think about before starting with XPV. In your XPV configurator, you can have a few options. These things contain like questions. These are, for example, parts to change. Dummy questions can be things like sizes, but that don't physically change the 3D model. Colors, just to change the outside color. Materials, if you want images on them. But also more advanced stuff like putting text on your 3D model or upload an image. The next thing you want to think about is how you're going to set up your pricing. Inside of XPV we can have a price per model or have a price per component. In this way you can have a price that adds up if we change options or materials or just have a full price at the end for a full product. And lastly, think about your 3D model. Who is going to make it? Which parts do I need? Which parts have to be separate? Which parts am I going to change? And which colors to use? So this is a full 3D model of a polo helmet. You can view it from every angle. So you can turn it around, spin it, angle it however you want. In this configurator, we have questions. We also have material groups or colors. So here you can select a different color for the top shell. For the base shell, we can select colors or materials. We can also select images. This configurator also has some dummy questions. In this case, it's the size. So this is the size of the helmet. You can select it, but it doesn't change the model, but it will be added to the end of your build. You can also select headbands. So you can select if you want an extra headband. This also adds a price, but it doesn't change the 3D model. You can also see that the base price of this helmet is 635 pounds. And if I add some certain materials like these camouflages, they add 185 pounds. And that will be added to the total price. The same goes for the straps I showed earlier. So if I select the two extra headbands, it will add 79 pounds to the total price. To conclude this video, it is best to think about your 3D model before starting with XPV. Also think about how you want to configure this model, which colors you want to use, which prints, if you want any images uploaded onto your model, and what questions you need to ask your customers. Thank you for following along in this lesson and I hope to see you in the next one.